Jeannie. How you feeling? Oh, Master, I'm so glad you called. I do not wish to worry you, but one of my feet is missing. <laughs> missing? Well, where'd you put it? I mean, I mean, how could one of your feet be missing? It just vanished. Oh, now, that's impossible. You must have misplaced it. Now, uh, you you uh, look for your foot while I wait. Try, try the end of your leg. No? Uh, did you look behind the couch? It has come back, Master. I, I knew you'd find it. But I'm losing my hand. Well, now, don't let your hand get away from you. Uh, hold on to your hand with your other hand. And, and don't panic. It could happen to anybody. I have it back, but I feel so weak. Now, now you, you stay there and, and, and hold on to your hands and feet until I get there. And if they start to disappear again, it's been nice chatting with you. Who was that, Captain? An old friend, sir. A man or woman? A woman. And her arms and her legs are missing? No, so they're back. I, I mean, it sounds like a case of delirium tremens. Your friend drinks a lot? I think it's safe to say she spends most of her time with her bottle. At least I think I see. With you, I never know. Uh, I owe you a lot, Captain. Me, sir? Yes. At one time, I was thinking of retiring, but um, I was getting bored. But do you know something? Once you came into the space program, I haven't had one boring minute. Well, I'm glad I'm able to amuse you, sir. Oh, I'm not amused. I'm baffled. And I'm going to stay right here until I get to the bottom of what it is about you that baffles me. Well, I'm really a very simple man. Of course you are. You drink salt water. You keep horses in your living room. You carry on conversations with bottles. And you know what you said on the phone to your friend just now when her hand disappeared? Uh, don't panic. It could happen to anyone. <laughs> just a figure of speech, sir. I'm going to add it to my collection. 